Welcome to DWBI Adda channel. Please subscribe for latest training videos. How you can create a custom environment Jupyter notebook using IBM Watson Studio. So this is your project. We will click on add to project. Choose the notebook. Here we will add a new name. Custom. Earlier we in the previous lesson we have selected this default environment. Now you can choose the another custom environment. Suppose you want to use default Spark 2.4 and Python 3.6. So it will show you these versions, Spark version and language on the create. Now it will create an instance of your instance of the runtime, the custom configuration which you have selected from this drop down. It's creating your Jupyter notebook. Now upload the data set. The data set is already there. So we will insert the code using Sparks and data frame. We will click on this. It will insert your code here, right? Now we will run it. It says waiting for Spark sessions to start. So it start running. It will show you the output of the ESV file. Apart from this, again, you can add the cell using this one and you can change the look of the cell, add the markdown and so on. Here you can again use the uh, share the file, download it and save the version. So it is uh, showing the output of first five records in the data file. We will click on this and you can change the name from here. Save the version if you want, we will save the version. Now we will go back to notebook. Under assets tab, it will show you the data set file which we have uploaded and the notebook which we have created. You can see here, this is your custom notebook. You have used this environment for this one. If you want make any changes, you need to unlock it first. Click on this and then you can Chain, make a changes to this file using these options and if you want to stop kernel you can use this one apart from this if we go to the environment tab here it is showing you the current environment if you want to change the environment you can choose from here again suppose you want to choose a spark and scala click on this It is showing you this version and click on the new notebook. Here you can put the new name like custom to and then you can see here this is already state which you have selected from previous right now you can click on the create. So now it change the environment of the notebook this was the all about how you can create the custom jupyter notebook or create or add the instance of the custom runtime into the notebook thank you so much for watching this video